And in Fox Money, it is Valentine's Day, the busiest day of the year for florists. And our Fox or 3's Maya Nicholson headed to Flower Power right here in Shreveport earlier today to get an up-close look at the action. And she joins me in studio with more. Good evening, Maya. Good evening, Jessamine. Earlier today, I went to that local flower shop in Shreveport, and I learned a lot about flower designing and the craziness that can happen on the rush of Valentine's Day. On Valentine's Day, many people buy things to show their loved ones affection, with the popular favorite being flowers. Our big seller this year is roses. It's a big rose year. Flower Power <laughs> is one of the last few local flower shops in Shreveport that still sell flowers on Valentine's Day. Working about three days in advance before Valentine's Day hits and we start um, making arrangements so that they can be easily picked up and walked out with as well as get out on delivery because we do about 200 deliveries on Valentine's Day. So it's we have a lot of work to get into it. We start planning back in December. We see probably about a 15 times increase in business just for Valentine's Day. Florists and designers start their flower arrangements months ahead of time in December. A lot of hard work, a lot of a lot of talking to people, a lot of like working on a lot of arrangements and it's honestly, this is honestly the best time I've had. The designs for Valentine's Day are beautiful, they are stunning. It took a lot of like particular placement and with the heart in the middle. Allowing for people to buy Valentine's Day arrangements weeks ahead of time and the day of. It's absolute, it's, it's happy chaos. <laughs> That's about as best as I can, as I can say what it is because we, uh, we're all running around trying to get everybody in and out as fast as possible plus all the people that took the time to order in advance. Saying she's witnessed altercations over their last few arrangements. So it's, it's pretty crazy on the day of. The family owned shop suggests people buy from local florists over chain stores. Best thing I can say is always make sure you order from a brick and mortar shop that's local to your um, uh, community. You're not going to get the quality that you would get from us because uh, we bring all of our flowers in fresh on Monday. Every Monday we're getting a new shipment so every week you order from us you're getting a fresh shipment of flowers. Yeah, shop manager Heather told me that if you are planning on buying flowers for Valentine's Day that you should complete it near the first of the month, saying that shops typically start to run out of flowers by the time Valentine's Day actually rolls around. Back to you, Jasmine. It is great to see uh, how much heart is put into those floral arrangements.